Assalamualaikum friends. Good evening. Welcome to the lecture series started by Lion on Lion on Nine, brought to you by Bangla Friends Law Firm Gujarat, and prepared by Jyoti Kashmani Baru and assisted by Akhil Aman Atta. This is our seventh lecture on PPC Pakistan Penal Code. The, uh, the lecture series which uh, we have started uh, on uh, Pakistan Penal Code. This is the seventh lecture on uh, uh, of that series. And we are discussing the topic of hurt. And today our topic is three, section 337 N of Pakistan Penal Code (PPC). And we will discuss in this section 337 N uh, about those cases in which the sas for hurt shall not be enforced. Before this, we have discussed in our lecture number six. Uh, 337M, in which we have discussed the herds which are not liable to kisas. But now, uh, now our topic is uh, such cases in which kisas for herds shall not be enforced. Herd is liable to kisas, but kisas shall not be enforced. This is the second category. First, we have discussed in 337M those herds which are not liable to kisas, and now we are going to discuss the cases in which Kisas is not enforced. Kisas ko lagu nahi kiya jayega. What are the what are those reasons why why kisas will not be enforced? There are four reasons. Number one, if the offender dies, if the offender dies before the execution of kisas, offender dies. First topic. First provision which is given under section 337N. We are discussing those cases in which kisas is not enforced. First one, if the offender dies, if the offender dies before execution of kisas, then how it is possible? From whom you will get kisas? Kisas will be executed only on offenders, not on his legal heirs. So in this situation, kisas is not enforceable. So it is quite impossible to enforce the kisas in this situation. Now come to second point, and that is if organ lost before execution of kisas, if the organ of the offenders lost before the execution of kisas, if, uh, for example, A amputates uh, right leg of B, but before execution of kisas, in a sudden accident, A also get damaged his right leg or get missed his right leg a ki bhi tong jo hai wo kat jati hai before the execution of kisas to is surat hal mein kya hoga kisas is not enforceable it is quite impossible that hurt was liable to kisas he was fully uh, his leg was in working condition he was fully but before uh, for example for the sake of argument for example uh, he was Going to appear in court where his uh, execution of kisas was going to be held, but in a way in, he met an accident and uski tan jo hai wo zayo jati hai. Now he had lost his organ, which was liable to kisas. In this situation, kisas is not possible to enforce. This was the second point. And now come to our third point, which is third point when the victim when the victim waived the kisas or compound the offense against some badre sula. Just like in those many courts, no matter, rasgam ho jata hai, wo aake intern bhi aane deta hai. I waive my right of kisas as well as I have pardoned the accused. Baat khatam ho gayi. In this situation, kisas is not enforceable. And now come to our next point. That is fourth point. Uh, of uh, such uh, cases in which kisas for hurt shall not lie, uh, shall not be enforced. That is last one. When the right of kisas devolves on a person who cannot claim kisas, this is a very important uh, piece. Uh, sorry, this is a very important topic. How you can say this is very important provision in this section 337N. As we have already discussed about first one, that is if offender dies, then kisas is not possible to execute. And exhaust is not enforceable if uh, uh, a phantom missed his organ before execution of kisas, that organ which was liable to be kisas, then definitely kisas is not possible and it is not, uh, uh, not executable. 
and that cannot be enforced. And third one, when the he waves, when the waves are kisas, and the home the offense. And now last one, which is very much important, what is that? When the right of kisas falls on a person who can claim the kisas, under this uh, under the under this penal code, there is some uh, under the uh, topic of kisas. We will uh, we will discuss in July in our uh, coming lectures. That uh, value of kisas, or what is kisas, and where it is enforceable, where it is not enforceable, and where uh, what kind of kisas, and what is the process to uh, execute uh, kisas. We will inshallah discuss in our coming lectures. But in this lecture, we have uh, this is the most important point. That when kisas is a shaks per devolve kar raha hai, ek aisa shaks. For example, for this, uh, agar A and B ko ne nusan ko chaya, ab A kon hai father. एक मिसाल है कि कौन है वो उसका सन है अब जो विक्टिम है वो सॉरी जो फेंडर है वो वही है विक्टिम का गॉडियन है उसका अब किसास इज नॉट पॉसिबल इन दिस सिचुएशन एंड बट इन इन फर्स्ट एंड सेकंड पार्ट अगर दो या फेंडर आए इसमें तो बात ही खत्म उसको सजा देने का सिलसिला खत्म हो गया एंड इफ आउट द लास्ट फॉर इफ ही If a defendant lost his argument before execution of kisas, then what type of punishment is provided for next? This may statute may diya gaya hai, but provided that the defendant shall be liable to urge and may also be liable to tazi, providing for the kind of urge. So, then, usko kis cheez mein leke jaya jayega? Is situation mein urge or tazi? Ye bolu jee, mein jayega. Or agar bail ki kisas ka kam ho, to to baat hi kam hogi. Next come to fourth point: if it is not possible. Why? Because the right of kisas devolves on such person who is not, uh, who cannot uh, claim kisas. So, what does the law say? The law says, "Offender shall be liable to urge, usko urge ki sabab." And if there is no other way, if there is any way other than the offender, if there is no other way, 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 There is no mercy other than the offender, and if there is no mercy other than the offender, he shall be liable to tazi provided for the kind of work caused by him. If there is no other mercy other than the offender, if there is no mercy, then tazi. Pass on, Jaggi. Now come to section three, three, seven, and subsection two. This is the provisions of section three, three, seven. Number one. Can there be not be standing anything contained in this chapter in all cases of hurt? The court may have to regard to the uh, kind of fraud caused by him in addition to the payment of urge. Now, this we have to do. We have to do it. So, 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 we have to do it. फिर उसमें उन्होंने कहा जी कि एक्चुअल में आर डिफेंस हैज बीन पुट बाय हिम इन द नेम और द प्रोटेक्शन ऑफ द ऑनर अगर उसने गैर के नाम पे ये किया है तो फिर उसको क्या किया जाएगा उसके लिए ये एक सेपरेट से सलाह भी उन्होंने साथ दे दी कि नॉट केस इन द हर कोर्ट में हैव टू रिगार्ड द काइंड ऑफ कॉज बाय इन एडिशन टू पेमेंट ऑफ अर्श नॉट तजीद अर्श के साथ साथ उसको तजीद की सजा भी लागू कर दी जाएगी इसमें आगे एक और प्रोविजन रखी गई वो क्या है दैट तजीद शुड नॉट बी लेस देन 1/3 ऑफ द अगर उसमें दस साल है तो कम से कम वन थर्ड सजा उसको होनी चाहिए वैसे तो अगर फॉर एग्जाम्पल आता है कि एक से लेकर तीन साल तक हो सकती है सॉरी तीन साल तक हो सकती है थ्री ईयर्स तक तो उसको एक वीक भी हो सकती है टू वीक भी हो सकती है थ्री वीक लेकिन यहाँ पर उन्होंने शर्त रख दी कि वो प्रीवियसली कन्विक्टेड है तो ये हार्ड एंड डेस्टिनेट क्रिमिनल है या उसने गैर के नाम में किया तो फिर उसमें कम से कम सजा की भी एक मैं रख दी है वन थर्ड वन थर्ड ये कम से कम एक साल एक साल से कम उसको सजा देने नहीं हो सकती ये इसमें उन्होंने एक प्रोविजन रखी है जी तो दिस वाज द ऑल बुक सेक्शन 337 थैंक यू वेरी मच अल्लाह हाफिज़